What's up, everybody, and welcome back to Rocco's Kitchen. Cheers. Tonight, we're going to be making a scallop pasta with a lemon cream sauce, and it's going to be fantastic. Now, let's stop talking about it and get started. First things first, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any more awesome videos that are going to be coming up in the future. Check out some from the past. Now, second, we gotta clean our scallops. Before we get on the stove, we're gonna take care of our scallops. I've already patted these dry with a paper towel. You want them as dry as they can be so you get a nice sear on them. And then, you're also gonna wanna take them, and you see there's a little knob on some of these guys that you wanna peel off. Well, it's gonna be on all of them unless they come clean. That's gonna be chewy, it's not good. You just throw that out. But, I know I'm kinda of far away, Hold on, let me, I'll come to you. Let's see, this is what we're talking about here. This little knob on there. We're gonna take that off. We're just gonna throw that out. We don't want that. Let's get on over to the stove. We're gonna start cooking. So we got our water back here boiling for our pasta. We're gonna salt that pretty heavily so it's salty like the sea. And I'm just going to put in about a quarter pound of spaghetti. I'm not making too much pasta tonight. It's just me and the wife. I don't really want leftovers. So that's what we're going to do. All right. So now while that's cooking, we're going to head on over to the saute pan where all the magic's going to happen. Our pasta's boiling. Got my pan getting hot over here on a medium-high heat. A little closer to high we're just gonna go in with some vegetable oil to coat the pan we're gonna use vegetable oil instead of extra virgin olive oil for this because we want to get that oil real hot and the extra virgin will burn before it gets if it gets that hot your vegetable oil lets you get hotter without smoking has a higher smoke point and that is so we can get a nice sear on these scallops while that oil's heating up I'm just gonna take my scallops here and season them with some salt and pepper on both sides season with the other hand so we don't contaminate our salt and pepper all right now I'm just gonna let this oil get to about smoke point I want it to start smoking a little bit before we add those scallops to it okay we have achieved smoke points. So now I'm going I am gonna bring my temperature down a little bit. We're gonna add our scallops. Now all I'm going to do is brown both sides of the scallops. So those are looking gorgeous and while those are browning my pasta finished so I got that strained and that's just sitting in the strainer in the sink. I'm going to pull my scallops out of the pan. And then we'll start building our sauce. So it's already hot. I'm just gonna take one clove of garlic. And 
half of a shallot, saute those. Until they get nice and soft. Until they just start to brown. And that garlic, I just sliced it real thin. Okay. That is cooking away. And it's just starting to brown already. So now we're gonna go in with half a cup of Chardonnay. Also, I'm going to squeeze in the juice of half of a lemon. All I'm doing here is catching the seeds while they fall out. You could use a strainer for that if you want to. Okay. Now I'm going to reduce this by about half. That'll just take a minute. I'm also going to bring the temperature back up to about medium high. Our wine lemon juice, sufficiently reduced. Let's go in with our heavy cream. That's one cup of heavy cream. Now I'm going to do the same thing. Let that come back to a simmer and reduce by half. Well, that's looking good. Now, we're gonna go back in with our scallops. I'll turn my heat down a little bit. I'm gonna season it with some salt and pepper. pasta. Also, I'm going to go in with about a tablespoon of some chopped parsley. And we'll just toss that all together. We'll let that cook together. Mary all those flavors. That's looking good. Okay, all that's left is to plate her up. I lied to you. It's not all that's left. We're going to throw in a pat of butter. Just a small pat of butter. That's going to make it a little silky. Add some richness. And then we're going to plate it up. <laughs> and I will see you back at the chopping block. So that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good night. We'll see you next time in Rocco's Kitchen. Cheers.